remember what the haters talking about. What's up, family? According to the Harris County Sheriff's Department, two men in Houston have been killed and seven people were injured during the filming of a rap video. The dead include 20-year-old Gonzalo Gonzalez and 22-year-old Jonathan Jimenez. Gone, just like that. Police suspect that they were ambushed. They said that the people that were there were all between the ages of 17 and 23. What the hell happened to hip hop? I remember there was a time when you were shooting a rap video and it was a time to celebrate. That's when everybody came out you know, you had the whole city, definitely the whole neighborhood would come out. And, you know, it was a celebration. It was lights, camera, action, you know, girls everywhere, people having a good time. Now, you go to a rap video, you might get ambushed. You may not make it out alive. That's part of this gun culture where people are waving guns and taking life for a joke. If a person is in ownership of a gun and they are not in ownership of their mind, they're not a rational thinking person eventually they're going to use that gun for the wrong reason. And when they have a problem, they're going to settle it with the gun. Even if they can beat the person fighting, if they can beat their opponent, they'll still pull out a gun because that's what you do when you got a gun. The gun stops everything. You pull the gun out. These guys, I think, you get to a point when you're flashing guns and people saying, you ain't going to do nothing, you ain't going to do nothing. Oh, there's a bunch of talking. Eventually, somebody starts squeezing off. So you got a couple of guys. We don't even know all the details. Let me say that also. Police have very little details. This just happened Saturday morning. So... They have very, very little details about this. They just know there's two guys killed. These are the age, age ranges, and these are the people that was injured. This is the area of the city that it happened in. This happened on the north side, like 45 North and Guff, uh, Guff Bank. Eventually, somebody is going to pull out some guns and prove to everybody else that they're about their life. And what they don't understand is now you got the two dead, they out of here. We don't again, we don't know the details. We don't know if these were innocent bystanders or if they were targeted or if they or even if they were innocent targets and or if they had done something in the past to somebody. We don't know what the details are. But that's where we are in this particular case. But I'm seeing way too many cases like this with dudes who are just pulling these guns out and people are rolling up to these video shoots and shooting. They think video shoot means shoot gun. <laughs> they are tripping. So it's just not like how it used to be. It's not fun. You know, they, they didn't take in the way to fun. You know, we could do a video shoot in the past and sometimes not even have security. Most times you would have some kind of security just to keep people in order. But you never think of having security to stop somebody from coming to the set to shoot people. Again, they're saying that these people were ambushed. They're saying that the cars that were parked there already, they're saying that there were cars already parked 
before the video shoot started and that they believe that the people that were shooting fired from those parked cars. They shot into the crowd. Young people just throwing their lives away. And I can guarantee you, I bet you a dollar to a donut. It was over nothing. No more talk. What the ladies talking about?